Hey. <laughs> Hello. Oh, I wanted to go live yesterday. I was so sick, dizzy, 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 dizzy. I suffer from low blood pressure. And if I fall behind on my dehydration, I cannot think. So I had to cancel yesterday's. I was supposed to go live every Friday. Friday should be the day I go live. I feel like, I don't know. I feel like that's a good day. I feel like Saturdays is a day for me to film all day if I have to. Because I don't stream in my support group today. So I have like all day to work on a project for YouTube. No chores or anything. My chores are done on Fridays. So, yeah. So I figured we'd come out here for, um, <laughs> she tried to print the recipe. Um, I have all different things we could do. You guys can choose which one you want to do. But I do want to open this um, rainbow high doll that I got on Clarence, guys. Um, that I love. So, yeah, I wanted to share this out. Hold on, guys. If you can, share it out. Thumbs it up. Share it out. All right, here we go. Where is my live? I can't find my live to share it out. So, hmm. Well, I better get started because um, opening up these Rainbow High dolls take for fucking ever. So here we go. This is the one I got on Clarence. Look. Do you have this one, Dolls Rescue? Um, Poppy, that's her name. I'm sitting here trying to think of her name. Poppy. Thank you, Ayla. It took me a couple minutes. I was looking on here. It's not behind here. Is it on here? Does it say Poppy? Does it not even say their name? Let me see here. No. I believe it does not say. Yeah, so, you know, I, I orange is not my favorite. That's probably why I passed her over. Then I started watching the show. She's from California, and I'm loving her. And she's $20. I thought, and she was the only one there. So I was like, if I leave her here and, she, and I come back and she's gone, I'm going to regret it. Ooh. I have to drink water tonight, guys, because I'm getting a tattoo tomorrow. I, um, I backed out of it the last time because I got too sleepy when the time came for me to get it. And I was like, I'm kind of tired. So I'm going to finally go back and get it. But yeah, so her name is Poppy and she's from California, but she goes to the um, school. And uh, we'll open her up and take a look at her. And um, unless you guys want to do game night instead. Well, we could do both. If you guys want me to open up her yet, though, because I don't have to open her up. If you guys want to get right to the game, because I have tons of games. So let me know. I'll read the room. I'm getting a clown. Just like a regular basic clown. I'm going to get it like right. I think I have room like right here. You know. Right here. Yes. Hello, Rainbow Fairy Center. Wednesday's here. Okay, so I love this doll because the back. Look at the back. Look at them all. This is one of the better series for me. I want her bad, but she's too much money right now. She's still high up there, like 39 bucks still around here. Her. I want her. She's got the best suit. And I have these boots, something like them. I have the same kind of boots. And mine are blue as well. Oh. Um, but, so, I watched... The, uh, the cartoon where she, for the first time, goes out in her gear. And she gets uh, stuck on the, um, she falls through the ice. Hi, Abe. Sunny bro. 
Yeah, if I'm not getting a Blythe doll, this is the doll I want. I want to collect fully, like full on collect. If it's not a Blythe, it's going to be a Rainbow High. And I like the LOL. I just got two of the. <clears throat> I just got two. Excuse me. I just got two of the um birthday present surprise lol dolls one from last year and the new one that just came out this year i got them for my birthday series because i'm already starting the, my birthday series is in may <laughs> but that's how far i have to work to get these series ready for you guys in order to have all these dolls and having money to collect them you know i'm always buying them at like the lowest price i can get these dolls so you'll be seeing the lol surprise um birthday ones which i really love but like they're different they're a different doll. They're like there for like different. But right here, these make me like Blythe makes me this much happy. Like, you know, Rainbow High is right in the middle. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's fine. Thank you for putting me on, Abe. I knew you were working, so that's why I didn't um forward it because I didn't want to bother you at work. I know that you work tonight. So I took this off. This is her extra outfit, which I liked. And I think it could fit Blythe, this dress. Ugh. I can't even talk. This dress. In the boots. Look at that. So cute. <laughs> we work on Easter in January. It's true. You have to work ahead of time in order. I've been celebrating Valentine's Day for a long time because I've had the dolls in my um. I keep, I store dolls that I haven't opened yet for the series in my um huge ass bathtub that we have that we don't use in our bathroom. It's like a jacuzzi tub that we just don't use. So we use it for storage, and all my dolls are in there <laughs> that I don't um open up yet. So, yeah, I've been looking at them for a while. I love the Valentine's series. Next Friday, I'm going to be going live, opening up another Valentine's doll that I'm not going to do a video for because we ordered her. She come in with no stand and no shoes and no brush, and it said in the description that it came with everything. And I'm like, no. So we ended up um, writing them and telling them, can you give us a return so I can ship it back on eBay? And they wouldn't. And then all of a sudden, eBay just gave us the, our, our full on um, refund and we got to keep the doll for free. So we kind of made out eBay takes care of you. That's why I, people are like, oh, when you sell, you don't go to Mercury or um. What's the one with the closet? What's the other one? I can't because I don't know if they're fully covered. Like e eBay's always hooking me up. But that again, I don't know. But yeah, so let's get into this doll. Do you guys want me to open the doll or you want to just get right into game night? It's up to you. I don't know if we have enough people that are going to play a game. So we could just dolly chat until, until the, um, if people come in here. We're just like we're just starting this up, anyways. Hopefully by the summer we'll, uh, we'll have like a bunch of people in here to play games. I could go later, but I feel like everybody's gonna be in bed, especially me. Open the doll, Parshmak. Yeah, I feel like I will fail at that. I am thinking of putting. Uh, I have a Palerina doll I want to sell. Oh, Wednesday, do you still have your Palerina doll with the red hair and the green dress? Hey, J Dolls UK. <laughs> Yahoo! Okay, Mercury is tell. I should have asked you. I knew I forgot that you sell on there. Like, you sell sell on there. Yeah, like eBay, like really hooks me up, like big time. And I get um free listings over there. I don't have to pay for anything because I have a status store, so I get like free listings every month. I don't have to pay. You sold her. I'm trying to sell mine. How much did you sell her for? I want I'm trying to get a lot of money for her, but I don't think I'm gonna be able to. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be able to get what I what I paid, and that's what I'm trying to get for her is what I paid for her. And I'm not gonna get that. I'm gonna take a loss. Did you take a loss with her? Hmm. I'm not like feeling her. The other Palerina dolls, I cannot. 
Yeah, see, that's not getting your money's worth. So um, Junior said there's no rush. He said, why? I said, should I lower it? Um, I don't see any competition out there. But I don't, you know, I have to pay for shipping. And it came right from the place, like, you know. Um, so um, Junior was like, no, just sit on it and let it stay there. So it's basically what somebody's going to pay if they get it themselves. It's just they don't have to go through all the crap of going out of the States to get it now. So that's how I look at it. But I figure maybe I can trade with somebody. There's a woman that wrote me um, that lives near me that she said that she might want to be like, she want to trade. She had originally asked me if, if I wanted to trade one of my blights because she's smitten by him. I'm like, that's like wanting to ask for one of my kids. <clears throat> I'm like, shipping is a killer. It To me, that's how much the doll costs. If it's like a $60 doll and $40 shipping, that's a $100 doll. I just bought a $100 doll to me. That's how I value my dolls. So I don't really sell dolls much. Like if I sell a doll, I totally don't want it. It's not worth really much to me. So whatever you want to pay is fine with me. But that doll is like, I could use it as a trade. I really could. I keep all my kids' dolls and toys, save the boxes. Yeah. Oh, you're a smart parent. You're a very, which way does this go? This way, right? Right, guys? I've always, I always struggle. During the video, I cut all this out so you don't see me swearing and struggling. Yeah. I'd rather, maybe I'll just save this doll for a trade. If there's a friend of mine that wants to do a trade with my doll, at least I have something that's worth a trade. Because I don't really have any dolls I want to give up. And when this person was like, oh, yeah, um, I might want to trade a Blythe doll for a Bobby. I'm like, gosh, that just made my ears bleed. Somebody's even saying that. Yeah. So, um, yeah. So, I don't know, if Jay, if you've seen, I paid $20 for this. I don't even know if that, that's not the best deal, but it's a deal. And it was the only one we had. And when I see a sticker like this, I give it a chance. <laughs> okay. So let me get this girl out of here. I don't want to make noise, guys. And I'm cutting out this picture back here. So let me... It's 11.30 p.m. there. What is it, what is it right now? 6.30 um, p.m. here. Let me know if I'm hurting you guys' ears. It's Poppy, yes. I really like her, guys. You know, I said that I don't mind at all starting a Dolly Zoom hangout. And we all go in my Zoom room and we watch this together. Because <laughs> I love this show. Um, I can go on J, uh, J Doll UK your time because I stay up pretty late. So I can always. Oh, wait. What are you? You're ahead of me. You go to bed earlier. I have to be up early. Oh, so she's a bargain? Oh, good. So I only have one other one, and it's the red girl. Ruby Anderson. I think that's her name. I see everything wrong, so. Oh. Um, so she came with skis and, um, I think it was you, uh, doll dress you, you said that they're, are they wrong? Are they, is everything done wrong? Like that's not how skis go. I'm a bad skier. Like I said before, I don't do anything that hurts me. I don't do anything that hurts my body. I'm pretty like, oh yeah, I play a seed. God. I'm five hours behind you. I want to do a dolly hangout so bad. The Denisa wants to do one. Uh, just like hang out and chat in my Zoom. But we could also go live on, on uh, together on a panel, too. We can also do that. That's also... Was hope I I yet to get a winter girl. Was hoping to get a slumber girl first, but nope. The slumber girls, like when things take off, they take off, huh? I I had I was lucky enough to get the blue girl, and that's it. Uh, what's her name? 
I the the dolls are crazy. Do you think it's um the adult doll collectors that are are taking everything? Gosh, I feel bad for the for the kids. <laughs> We're taking all their toys. Are we taking the kids' toys? Because now I'm gonna feel bad. I don't feel like that when I collect life because kids don't collect life. Oh shit. Like, you see these people going out and buying lots of dolls in, like, bunches of them. And I'm like, wow, aren't you going to leave any for the kiddos? Dang. I don't know. That's how I think. And I don't know. And I'm not even a Mother Teresa type. I just feel, like, bad for the kids. Yeah. Dolly. That's what I don't want to be when I sell my Palerina doll. I don't want to scalp anybody. But that's exactly what you'll pay. If you get it from the place with the shipping. So that's what I'm trying to get. And I was trying to tell my boyfriend that. I said, I am not ever going to be a dolly, um, a doll, what is it? Doll scalper. I, that's mean. That's freaking mean. The people that do that for the rainbow high, the monster high. Ooh. Ooh. But you know what I'm into now? I'm into ever after high. I love ever after high. I'm starting to collect them. I have a few already. Um. They, they remind me of Monster High, um, and I love them. I think they're pretty and they're fun. Hi, Denisa. There's enough of a kid, she says. Not around my place. Oh, it's so slim pickings around here. All right, so here she is, guys. She is cute. She has, I, this isn't my studio, so I don't have any lights or anything. But, and this is my computer we're streaming through. So, but can you see her freckles? Yeah, Winter Poppy. I like her. Um, and orange isn't a lot of people's favorite color. Not mine either. These are my favorite scissors to cut off those things on the back of the head, the little scissors. She is so cute, isn't she? That's what I thought. Now, if you watch the cartoon, and I've, I think I've already said it, but let's talk about it again. <laughs> If you watch the cartoon of this winter break, you know, it shows them all in their stuff and it's winter break and everybody's leaving to go home for the, um, for the, for the break. And she stays and she wants to go ice skating for the first time to see snow, but everybody else is like not being, um, considerate to her cause they're not, um, she doesn't know what snow is and they're over it already. They're like, yeah, we'll go later. And she's like, but I want to see it. So she goes by herself. And then she falls through the lake and they got to save her. So that's, she's skating with these on and, um, yeah, the cartoon, Dolly Joy, Lisa, you watched the cartoon. Isn't it so cute? I can bang out like five episodes in a row because they're eight minutes long. Yeah, she, she fell on, yeah, she got, she, and then everybody had, they were like, oh, wait, where is she? And then. Who was it that came in and was like, hello? Oh, it was Ruby Anderson. She was like, hello, you can't leave her out there. And then they went and she was in trouble. <laughs> Look at me. And she was in trouble. Hey, I'm so into it. I think it's a lovely cartoon. I really do. The cartoon's awesome. It's only eight minutes long, the episodes. So if you want to just do one episode, what you know, while you're putting your makeup on or whatever you do, to your, you know, face mask, I have no idea. But I do love the cartoon. Now, the cartoon's making me want dolls that I didn't want before. It's good. It's a good. It's well made. Now, because I went to go watch Ever After High, because that's also on there. And it's not, it's nice, but it's not as well made as this. Now, if you have um, Jet Dawson in her, like, I have that um, fitting, um, the fitting foam the form fitting thing she came with and all that that's on the cartoon uh, the dorm is on there the dorm door is do is the lord is had the best video with the winter oh i know she has them all there that's expensive to get them all to be honest there this is a very pricey set is the winter which i mean come on it comes with skis it comes with a stand, comes with all this, and then you got the second outfit, which is bomb. So, I mean, in the shoes. Come on, the winter boots. So, I mean, I think it's worth it. It's just I'm not, yeah, for, oh, just about 40 per, and I got her for 20, so that's why I grabbed her. I was like, I need her now. I'm trying to get them low. Now, the new um, Luna year 
Yeah, but you have two good ones. Um, you have Poppy and you have Skyla, which is good. Because you have Poppy, right? You have Poppy Chia. Is Poppy in Chia? Yeah, she's in Chia, right? There's an orange one. Or is yeah, but there's no other orange besides her. Yeah, you got Luna, right? The Denisa got Luna, which to me is the prettiest doll besides my favorite. My favorite is Kaya Hat. I I'm in love with Kaya Hat. In love. I've never liked a Playline doll like I like Kaya, Kaya Hat. I don't know if it's her, the way her body is built. Yeah, and she's got the freckles. Fall, but she's from California. She's a she's a uh, a a West Coast girl. Yeah, the blue is Skyla. Oh, you get yeah, I got Kaya. I got Kaya. I seen you got Kaya right before me, I think. I think I seen your video and I was like, I'm just gonna get her in her with her jeans on. I'll never change her out of her jeans. That whole look, she comes with her high heels. I I'm in love with it. I would have to get a second Kaya. I told I told Junior, I said. I need an insurance, Kaya. He goes, what's an insurance, Kaya? I go, um, in case something happens to this, Kaya. <laughs> I've, I've been watching the cartoon. So once you watch the cartoon, you know the names. Plus, I mean, if you're buying a doll and spending $40 on it, you know, I like to remember their names. <laughs> Yeah, red hair and freckles. Um, this one comes with uh, earmuffs. And the only other one in this uh, line that comes with earmuffs is the purple one. Which is, what's her name? Vi Violet, right? Yeah, like, a, an ins that's what I call an insurance doll. Like, I need an insurance Kaya hot bad. I want her. I want... Um, then I'll change the second one into her second outfit and I'll have two Kayas. But I'm never taking her out of those jeans. Those jeans to me are a home run. The whole outfit, the whole doll. Her hair is <laughs> done double. I want, she, he's like, I'm like, please. <laughs> the earmuffs are, yeah. Oh, they become earrings? Is that what these things are if you take them off? Oh, yeah, they do become earrings. I see. Yeah, I, I like that right there. I just, I think this is a doll that in the future when, I because to me, Mattel is just not picking up the pace. Where is your pace, Mattel? Thanks, Ayla. <laughs> Ayla's working for my channel and for her. <laughs> Um, yeah, I think these are the dolls that are going to make us happy in the future. They're well built. They're bigger. I'm going to be showing a Bobby, a nice Bobby in, uh, for, for St. Patrick's Day. But as far as like that, the Mattel, they just, well, yeah, that's why you need, oh yeah, right. So what are you going to do? You, you already said he's getting very. Thin and wilted. You have to look into somebody to stuff him somehow. Like somebody that can open him up from the back like surgery and just, you know, they did it on the Wizard of Oz. <laughs> uh, she's a very pretty doll, too. It's funny. The um the AliExpress dolls, they seem to all look alike when you're shopping, but when you get them, they're a little different. Oh, yeah. Oh, does she have a neck articulation? She does. Yes. And their hair is nice. Um, yeah, I just, I thought this doll was cool. And I think her second outfit is nice. And I definitely can use this for Blythe because I like stuff like this. You see? Now, have you noticed how their clothes went from being um, kiddish for, to now being a little bit more, not adult. Because I know these colors are kind of loud. The rainbow's loud. They need to add brown to the rainbow. Because I know it's not in there, but we need a brunette. You know what I mean? With yellow, you get a blonde. You know? No fair. We need a brunette. 
So I would love to see a brunette rainbow high doll just add, like, put, like, oopsie daisy collar. Be like, oops, all the colors mixed together makes brown. And give us a damn brown one. The scarecrow from Wizard of Oz. That's what Gilly needs. And if you could film that, if you could find somewhere in Florida where that that restuffs teddy bears they definitely know how to do gilly i bet you any money you can look it up on here yeah look at this whole thing i already um did kaya hot second outfit on blythe anything that you have to have like depend on the waist to hold it up it's not going to ever fit a blythe their waists are not the same but a dress however yes this will fit a Blythe because up here you could do the shirts. Like a build a gilly. <laughs> build a gilly. Oh, guys, so I don't know if I told you. I have an announcement, but I can't show you. I totally keep on forgetting until I look at myself. I'm coming out with a vlog, okay? And um, I'm still working on it because I'm going for my tattoo. It's just a vlog of me, like, kind of uh changing every i used to go for tattoos every month and i don't do it anymore like i do dolls instead like i'm covered in tattoos um but i'm gonna go for one i haven't been for one since after i got sick i went for one because um if you're sick and you don't have an immune system you're not allowed to get a tattoo the tattoo parlor won't do it if they're ethical eth eth ethical whatever that is whatever that that word is and your doctors won't let you have to wait but um i'm getting a tattoo but this week last week uh -huh, tattoos i mean they're awesome but if you are if, if i didn't have any now i wouldn't stop i wouldn't stop i love princess kate you you see what princess kate looks like when she's in a dress <gasps> the simplicity of her is so elegant that I, I fall off the couch. Ah, I think she's so pretty. Yeah, yours are nice Wednesday. Yours are nice. Yours are really nice. Like mine are, I've been getting them since I was 14, okay? Young. I got them young. I got one on my, my waist that nobody knew about young. Then I went with my friend. We went to Six Flags. I was a little bit older. We got another one. And then I just kept on going. You know what I mean? But yours, Wednesday, yours look nice in, like, jewelry, goth, ick. They're all black, right? You got all shaded or black. Mine are all color, so I have to stick with it. I have kids. Kids have done this. This is this was a project. I had three different kindergarten classes work on this. I wanted a kid um, to draw me a sunshine, but they couldn't draw me a sunshine. I just wanted the kids to draw, um like... I was doing this thing where um, kids develop happy and healthy inside. Um, you can tell through their drawings. And if they put a sunshine in the corner of their paper, that means they're happy. I loved that when I read that when I was younger. So I got this. I had a bunch of kids do it. You just want a word. What word do you want? Like faith or... I love just words. Um, yeah, so um, what I did this week, now you guys know, I hate my hair, right? I, I have that, like, you know those people that go through that thing where they want to cut off their arm because they hate their arm? <laughs> well, I have that with my hair. I needed it off. So what I did last week, yeah, strength of faith, yeah, definitely. Something to keep you, you know. Something that makes you happy. Like something that that's you. And that's what you are. Faith and strength. So um, I have, I have, I had to like uh, cut it off. So last weekend, and my boyfriend's been asking me to do it. He shaved my, my hair. He bought me a bunch of dolls. We bought a bottle of champagne. And he shaved my hair. All off. Guys, so <laughs> it's nice. It's just needs to be colored now. I took all my blonde out, which I need my blonde. So I'm dyeing it now this week. I wanted to give myself a week to adjust to no hair. And, oh, I love the smart doll. No, I'm not taking it off yet. It's not ready. It's not ready. 
I like the no hair. It's just, um, it needs to be colored. It's all black in black and gray. And I don't like that. I don't like it when it's long. I don't like it when it's short, but I did. I'm well, there's see, there's hair there. You guys can see, see, you guys can see the top. You guys didn't even notice because you know why? I was getting my hair done every month just to put a hat on. I love my hat. She goes, I'll wait. Well, I'm coming out with the vlog. I vlogged everything. I put my camera here. He stood here. And I drank my champagne. And I was opening dolls. And I was changing my Scentsy buddy, um, Dolly. I was changing her into outfits and talking to you guys. And... Yeah, it, it's okay. Like, my hair was never good, okay? It's just so thin. It, it's always been thin. But I used to cut it short and make it work. But then after the chemo, it never grew. Like, parts of it never grew. Um, I didn't lose my hair during the chemo, ever. It just made, the chemo made my hair shitty. Like, straight up dry. Doesn't grow. Like, a little patch in the back, like a baby. You know when you lay down? And a baby has the bald spot on their head from laying. I had something like that and it wouldn't grow. Well, you, look at your gorgeous mane of hair you have. I wouldn't cut you as either. I needed to either see what this was like, like shave my head, just to feel it. And maybe appreciate my hair a little bit more than I was because I was heating it. Like, I didn't want to wash it. I didn't want to brush it. I didn't want to pay $120 to go get it done to just put it in a hat. So that's why I was like, my boyfriend's like, can you just shave it so we can see what it looks like? He wants me to um, put red eye makeup on when we go out and um, once a year. I, I like it. I like the no hair. I just think it needs to be blonde. It's it's gray and black. And it's just, it bothers me. And it doesn't bother me a lot. It just bothers me a little bit. Yeah. I like it. I like it. I'm going to play with it for a little bit. And then when I grow it in, I'll start um, dreads, I think. Because I've always wanted dreads. So if I start from the beginning and just do the dreads by my mid-40s and 50s, I'll have some nice dreads. That will be locked. And all I have to do is tie them back. And then there's no hair maintenance. I, I really can't handle the hair maintenance. And guys, like my ostomy, you know, I have a hot, an ostomy down there, right? It's changing form because I've had it a long time. So I have to like get used to a different device. So it's like a whole 20 minutes in my routine during the day extra. So now I'm like, I don't want any hair. Why? What? Why? What do you mean? If I wasn't fifty-four, because I'm not. I'm forty-three. To me, we're in the same box. So why? 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 Will I look like I'm trying to be young? Because I feel like that's like a. I feel like that's not a young thing. I feel like that's a. I feel like that's a a kind of like mentality. I think a person that has dreads has a, a mentality like of like. I can't be dealing with, I so why, why I want dreads after they're locked. It takes a while. It takes a while to lock them. I'm going to try to put on her boots because I think I like these boots better than her ice skates. I think you should do it. You have nice hair to do it. Your hair would lock up in no time. Mine? <sighs> It's like uh, soft as shit. I just, ugh. It's so, I wish it was thicker, guys. It's just not thick, and it makes me so sad. I want these boots on instead. And how do you get these kind, kind of boots on their feet? Are we not supposed to have the socks on? Let's take the socks off. Well, if it doesn't matter, maybe, I, well, you think, you should. I think what I mean is I just... My oh, he didn't take away your youth. Not 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 from my view, honey. But you know, I get we I get what you say. After chemo, 
I was before chemo, I was, uh, you know, going to yoga and I was trim and fit and I could literally jump into skinny jeans and jump out of them. No problem. And a- after my chemo, it, it really aged me. And I, I feel like what you're saying, but oh, don't worry about it. it. You're not aged. So what do I do with these boots? Do I keep the socks on? I don't like the boots with the socks off. My feet would be so creepy inside of a boot. So you you only have those. Do you have this one right here? This outfit? This is the first outfit? These boots are, are awesome. I love these kind of boots. I don't know if I'm doing it right, though. Hi, enjoy it, bro. Well, you have the smallest feet ever, hun. Me? Me? Not me. Well, yeah, I do, actually. I do. My, my feet are small. Ugh. Too small, probably. Yeah, I can't get this boot on with this, which is sad. Because I want it like this. Oh, no. Do I not? What do I want to do? Oh, you want pajama jeans? <laughs> What's that? Pajama jeans. Pajamas that look like jeans, like fake jeans. They make those, don't they? They got to make them. All right, so we're going to put her. Oh, shoot. I got her wrong shoes on. I've missed your adorable South Boston accent. Wow, you can tell from what part I'm from, too, huh? <gasps> Guys, why does her feet look so weird? I don't know. Her feet look funny, but maybe it's me. They're leggings that look like jeans. Oh, no, one second. I just dropped this. Okay. <laughs> All right. So, or oh, riding pants. She is so pretty. Um, I've been watching that girl, uh, um, Denisa. You, you, we were talking about her when we were in the hotel. Ex, ex, Kidana Desis. I can't say her name. Only she can say it. Ex, ex Canadian is. Oh, I have teddy bears. Yes, I have a teddy bear collection. I could do a teddy bear collection one day live if you would like. Definitely. I'd have to go dig them out. First of all, there's a hole in Poppy's sock. Ew. Ew. I've dumped guys for having holes in their socks. I do not like that. Oh! Whoa, how cheap is that? Both of her socks have holes in them. Dolly Joy Lissa with a super chat. Oh my gosh, thank you for the super... Thank you for the super chat. You are the best. Yeah, so I've um oh, you can't have you can't have tight on your back for because of your um your shoulder or is it cuz your back because my back? I've had two surgeries on my back. Oh. Let me tell you. That shit is brutal. Yeah, I'm I don't know why I took off her shoes. Now I'm all upset because of the socks. I do not like. I don't like tight anywhere either. And you know. I'm not so cute. I like. um Baggy. I wear the same black like. Um, capri pants. And, and just like old band t-shirts. That I went to concerts. So I've had spinal surgery too. Two of them. Two of them, because the first one wasn't enough. Hey, and then after, right after my third, my second one, they found cancer in me. Gave her a customized rainbow high with black hair. Yeah, ex-candidensis. Ex yeah, so she had the brown rainbow high. I really like her videos. She's She's so cute. Oh, I'm okay now. That was 2014 was my first surgery. Then 2016 was my second surgery. 
Then they found the cancer like a month after that. And then I stopped my chemo treatments in 2018, I think. And uh, I'm hitting remission this year. Yes. So, so no cancer in this body. I mean, hopefully. <laughs> you had two in a week. Hey, I know exactly what you're going through. Is your scar right above the crack of your butt? Is it long going up this way? Because, oh, God. That part hurts, but she is so humble. <laughs> I love that girl. I watch her in the morning. I get up in the morning, and I try to hit everybody I can. In my morning, it's 2. I get up at 2 in the afternoon because um, I stay up late. Sometimes I'm up till 4 in the morning listing on eBay to pay for my dolls. <laughs> Look at this. It's sewn to her, her thing so it stays here. I'm going to leave it there just for shits and giggles. So, guys, I, yeah, but that's okay. I like to wake up to text, though. It, nothing bothers me. My stuff's always on silent anyway. That's why I don't, I miss a lot of calls, but I wake up late. But you know what? I don't get my, uh, I get a boost of energy during um, um, my, um, streaming in with uh, me and Ayla we stream shows at night together and we do a few in a row and then Junior will come home and I'll stay up and I'll be typing out my eBay listings all night broken every shape the lumbar spine fused together hell with screws and rods yeah you had major mate you have on it. yes lots of swimming would be good for you and laying on the ground after you're healed up a little bit and just letting gravity do its thing. That always helped me with my back after I healed. It was after I healed, though. You need to wait a little bit, unfortunately. But but put on um, vitamin E on the scar. Because what happens is the scar doesn't stretch. And, you know, like, honestly, you're going to want to go to the bathroom. And you need to be able to stretch your muscles down there. So always put vitamin E on that scat so it can, like, stretch for you. Oh, God, I know what that's like. I'm so glad you're okay, Jay. I can feel, like, what you are going through. You, you always, um, you feel like you're in a little box this big when you're sick. It's so weird. It's lonely. Nine years ago. Yeah, so we were almost both in the same predicky. The Bratz. I almost broke down and bought another Bratz because I'm collecting dolls from my birthday series. And they have a, cute, a pretty cute birthday doll. Um, so my sister... Um, which I don't see often. Um, I'm actually a strange, strange from my family or whatever, but my, I'm, I, I'm on talking terms with one of my sisters and I just bought her baby, uh, a doll for Madeline, Madam Alexander. Love you all. Gotta go. Bye Dolly Joy, Lissa. And, um, so I wanted to get her a baby doll. You know what I mean from me? And look at this doll. Okay, guys, I have to show you because it's not mine. I can't unbox it. Yeah. Oh, you have to wear your brace every day. Hubby's going to have to give you a rub down. So isn't this baby cute? It's Madam Alexander baby. Isn't she cute? Yeah, every day, Jay, you're going to get better. Every single day. Lots of breathing. Um, believe it or not, oxygen heals. It heals. So if you do that. So she's cute, right? Oh, yeah, she's so cute. What a precious face. So this was on um, Amazon. And it was, here's the different ones. You can get different shades. Uh I asked her what her baby's colors are, and she said the room is green. I should have went with purple or pink, but I went with green. 
I don't know why I did that because the, the odds of me hitting the shade of green she's got is odd. So I should have went off from it, but I didn't. So I'm a dummy. Oh, yeah, this this live is always um, it will be up after you you can go through it if you want later. Yes, so sweet. Or you don't even have to rewatch it. These lives, they're just for fun. I don't think you could get a true, um, like, a doll, like, review out of a live to me. Like, this this doll I didn't do a video for because, I don't know, like, I feel like dolls that are, that have been done, you know, over and over again, I feel like, why should I bother with the editing when I can just talk with you guys during it? So, I think with these kind of dolls, I'll do live. And then the, the ones that, um, hi, Justin Hall. Hello. Yeah, this is not green natural. This is like a mint green. But she's cute, is she not? I'm dying to know if she smells like uh Big Brats babies. That's right. My accent. Sometimes when I'm editing, I'm like, I can't I can't tell apart what I'm trying to my my words. They're so smashed together. Oh, I don't know how to do hair, though. That's the only thing with me. I don't know how to do hair. Like, at all. Oh, we got uh, 10, 11, 13 more minutes for my live. We'll just do Dolly Chat. We'll do game night next time. There is a lot of, well, there's a lot of people watching. I don't know if there's a lot of people talking. But if, you know, next time we can do um, Family Feud next Friday, guys. I can go live at 6. And I always can go longer if if the if if it's hopping. I don't have to end it after an hour. I just think chatting for an hour live is good enough. But we could do that next Friday. Um. Yeah, doesn't she look soft and kindly? And look at the box. Like, how pretty is this to present to a baby? They said that um in this it's a sensory doll. It's a sensory nurse nurturing doll. So, but I think the face is classic. That little face. Now I want a big brat's baby. I did see those. Those are cute. Yay, Friday. We'll do game night. Starting at 6. Well, after my live. I have a live up until um, Valentine's Day. I'm doing Valentine's Day a big party with my boys. I'm doing the photo shoot with the music. I'm going to try to make it a little longer because I really look. I mean, I really work hard on those with the props and all and send them up to just do it for like four or five minutes. I think I might make it like 10 to 15 with like lots of good music, lots of doll photography. Wednesdays, doesn't that doll in the green look like the singer with the brother? No, don't say that. An Osmond doll. Hey, I'm doing that. Um, that is the Friday after. So what I'm gonna do is we're doing the ugly doll giveaway. I have all these dolls. I'm keeping one for myself because I found a use for one. Okay, I found a use for one, the one that's um shaped like a caterpillar. I'm gonna use her in the summer for like a, a wilderness shoe. I think it'll be funny. But the butterfly, which is the most important one, I guess she's the one that's hosting the party. We're gonna, and then I gave one to Dolls Rescued when she came down here. I wanted to give her one. So now we're gonna, I think the doll's ugly as sin. I do not like this doll. I didn't pay money for these dolls. I came into them to sell and they're just not moving in my store. They're just not. There's so many of them out there. I'm telling you, she over marketed herself. Nobody wants these dolls. So I found a useful one and I'm sure my friends want this ugly doll in their collection just to have an ugly doll in your collection. If somebody's like, oh my God, do you have an ugly doll that I can borrow? And you'd be like, oh my God, I do. Actually, I have Marie Osmond's doll. You got the ladybug. Yeah. I took, I figure if you want to like, you know, take the clothes off and use it for a pad and for something. I, I you know what I mean. I was singing that. I just own the Osmond baby. You know what? I should have bought that one instead of the one I got, but I had already bought that one. And for me to go back and buy, take my precious freaking money, 
My precious hard-earned money and buy another one of her dolls? Shoot me. Shoot me. <laughs> no. Um, I need to save for Blythe and Rainbow High. I'm actually paying off, like I'm always saying, two dolls right now at the same time to Blythe. Because I've been like a long time without a Blythe since the summer. The last time, well, I got, I opened it on Halloween, but the last time I paid one off. You like the ladybug. I thought you were just being, you know, polite and nice to me, but I was going to like send it as a, a jokey and, um, I just think it's hilarious, but you like it. Hey, you know what? One person's trash is another person's treasure. I like the bug one has this big ass tail and I think it will look good in a picture. So I kept her. But the butterfly, Madam Butterfly, she's actually really beautiful. I'm going to just uh, hold the giveaway, a live giveaway. And it's going to be a share out my um, my video in my channel giveaway. And every time somebody shares it out, I'll put their name in. And then we'll do a live drawing. I'll, put, I'll show your name and we'll put it in. So, like, say, like, Dolls Rescued shares out my video a bunch of times. She gets a bunch of times in there, you know. And that's how I do my, my giveaways. There's too many people that come into my lives just to enter a giveaway. None of the present company not included here. No, not one person I'm talking about here. I'm talking about people I never see ever. And all of a sudden I'm having a giveaway and I'm like, who, who the hell are you? You do not support me. To me, if I'm watching your video, you know it because I want to like it. And, and leave a comment. It's very rare that I walk away from a video without a comment that I've watched. I have to really be busy to not comment. Like, I'm always going to tell you, hi. I go like this. I start my lives out like this. I start, like, when the ad comes, I go, hi. And I let it sit there for a second, play the ad for a little bit. And then I go to the video and I start, you know, trail commenting. Yeah, that's not happening to me anymore. No more is that happening to me. Yeah, you can't. Yeah, that's why giveaways have to be done fair. They can be done fair, but it, I think people should do it by, um, especially smaller channels. When you're a huge channel, I mean, that's different. I'm a small channel, so I can control my giveaway how I want, like, and it can be fair. What I do is every single time somebody leaves a comment or comes in my live, I write your name and it goes in there. So your odds of winning are going to get better the more attendance you come. Some people don't have as many. You know what I mean? Some people are right there, like, together, like, they do it. They, they're, like, I, like my Christmas one was so close that I had to I had to pick three winners because I just thought, you know, this is, I mean, this is tough. I'm just going to get three presents. <laughs> I'll never hit a million subscribers. I don't know if it's in my stars or whatever they say. The only reason why is because will I be able to be me? When you're like that, like, I heard you can't be yourself. Like, all right, we're just talking about me wanting dreads, right? Am I allowed to get dreads? You know what I mean? When you're famous, you're not allowed to get dreads if you're a white girl. And I'm a white girl. You know what I mean? So, I mean, do I want to be famous? I don't know. There's a price that comes with it. Hey, as long as there's food in my belly and a roof over my head and a doll in my hand... <laughs> I'm, I'm really good with my channel being like this. I really love my friends that I got. Um, yeah, I watch the commercials, the videos. Yeah, you gotta like, like, I don't know. I think when I started um, YouTube, um, I got linked up in a group of friends that taught me how to support the right way. And I just got into that habit. And as soon as I go to a video, I, autom I automatically first like it. And then you watch the ad, you start to watch it, and I comment as I go. I Yeah, definitely. Oh, yeah. I love when I, I wake up, I see Jay's first. Because Jay's comments are always at night when I'm sleeping. And then I wake up. Um, I do not have a life-size doll with sexual function, but my smart doll does kind of resemble one a little bit. <laughs> um, and yeah, I, I guess I don't need the sexual function doll, you know. My sexual function is just functioning just right. <laughs> 
Is that not Dolly Talk? Ikurishka. Yeah, you see Jay's first. Hey, that that uh that um card swap you guys are doing, that's interesting. I might want to jump in on that one time. I don't really have a character though. You guys all have characters like Gilly and Oh yeah, Jay, what do you do? You just pick a doll? It looks interesting. It looks it looks like you can keep up with it. What's up, trend? Sunny bro. <laughs> um also what we can do next week is we can open candy from 1960s. We can do that next Friday too as well with the game in between. I bought stuff for live streaming. Oh, yeah, I say her her name wrong. I spell it wrong. I say it wrong. I actually was listening to Jay say it today, and I was like, ah, that's how you say it. Yeah, that looks kind of fun. I might have to pick a, a doll out. Yeah, I, did, I would have to pick a doll and do that. That looked fun. I've been watching them for a couple weeks. I only like to um, do the things that I know that I can do not half-ass, and that looks like I can do it because I can't make clothes. So every single time you guys have, like, a a challenge that's making clothes I feel like so ill-equipped but I do have oh guys I could show you right now hold on I can't <laughs> look it I'm gonna learn I'm gonna learn guys I'm going to learn with you. Me and the Denisa, we're going to set up a dolly hangout whenever we both have time. <laughs> and look, at I got string. I could tie up the whole world with the string I got in here. You have no idea. And then also want to see what I found at a yard sale. Yeah, I definitely want to learn. I'm just like, I don't know. I feel like I suck, but. I never want to stop. Yeah. <laughs> but look what I found. Look, a bunch of zippers. Look. Look at these zippers. I think they're going to be too big for Blythe clothes, but look. Maybe I can make a bag or something. Look. Wait, does this even work? Oh, yeah, it does. Look. Look. Cool, right? I can send out some to some of my friends. I can say, I bet a zipper can come in handy, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Uh, Allison, what in the actual F did I do? I forgot about this. Hold on. Guys, the main reason why I went live, <laughs> I didn't even do it. What? Okay. I don't want to show you the front, but this is from Gilly. Let's open it, guys. So we'll go over an hour a little bit. Hey. No, no. She woke up. He hears me laughing. I'm sorry, Allison. You know why? I put it over there and it was out of my eye view. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to see this. Oh, wow. Is this an apron? Is this... <laughs> Is this an apron? Oh, Wallace. Oh, this is so cute. <laughs> this is so cute. Wait, let me see if it can go on my on all my blight down here. Uh, let's see. Does it go? It goes. Uh... Do I have one of those books, like a book, like with patterns? Oh, it's a dress. Okay, so the arms go through here and it wraps around here. Like this? Like this? Oh, I love Gilly for making this for me. I'm gonna do a get ready with, with me with this. You just wait for the summer. Look at it, it's got the little look. <laughs> this is so cute. This was the reason why we we're gonna go live. I should have put it out. And then here's my card. It's my Valentine. I can grease it now. You could cook in your play. 
I definitely want to learn how to sew. I wish we could have like a uh, like a little sewing circle in my Zoom. Wouldn't that be fun if we were all in there sewing together? Dress and headband are st <laughs> staples. <laughs> oh, there's a headband right here. Like this. Monsters Ink Fabric. I whenever I go out and I see anything that's blue, I think of um Wednesdays with Gilly. Well, if anybody else wants to set it up, I have the Zoom room. So I and I'm always free. So if anybody wants to get together with their sewing stuff and your staples <laughs> and sit in a Zoom like this, we would all be like this. And we'd be hanging out. It would be like we're like in a circle, like like uh like little little women <laughs> making a quilt, you know? Let's put where is the top of her her stand? Like I can't find it. And that's that's making me mad. The top of her stand I can't find. <laughs> yeah, you can make those cookies. Follow the, they they weren't bad to make. Um the uh the roses, they don't taste like anything, like nothing. So it's just to me, it's just for looks. So that's actually good. <laughs> but yeah, so that is today's live. I would like to do a crafting Zoom session, whatever. Whenever if anybody wants to help me set it up in can you know contact or do a like a, a dolly chat, like do a a dolly uh, text chat to set up a Zoom. I'm down to whenever. Just let me know. We can work off of Jay Doll's time too sometimes. There's my boyfriend right there, Junior. Yahoo! The roses are made from roses. They're food grade roses. Whatever that means. Oh, cool, Jay. So we'll do a Zoom. Um, we'll have to, like, set up a chat so we can plan it. And as many people as we want can go in there. And we can all hang out at once and teach each other stuff. Because I got um my uh, sewing machine all there already. Hope all is good, he said. Yes. Yes. What, we're, we're just about to end the live, actually. I was just showing Gilly's dress. Gilly made me me a oh, one of my dolls a dress. Probably solitude. Hi, the real prince. Brian says hi, Junior. I would love a Zoom with Dolls Rescued, Jay, all of us in here. Wednesdays with Gilly. She could teach us how to staple. <laughs> I just don't know how to get this thing going. Like, look, it's a kid one. Uh, it, it wasn't mine to begin with, but it's mine now. And I have to get the needle in. So, I mean, we have to start here with the needle. And I don't even know how. Like, I'm assuming you stick it in the hole, like, here. But, like, what do you do after that? Like, so, it's good dust on everything. But, yeah, so this is my kid one. You're always going to be on a doll. Oh, you just wait. Yeah, so I got that. I got tons of thread. And, um... Yeah, so I think we should we should get that going. We should get like some sort of a chat. If somebody could uh get that going, a chat, you know, like a text, a universal text chat that we can be like, "Hi." I also have um, "Hi Owen." Owen Cavallo's in here too, Junior's boy. Um I also have uh, the Dolly Scavenges on Facebook. I just joined um, your J, uh, J Dolls UK. I just joined your group today. I didn't even know you guys had a Dolly group. But I have a Dolly group too. Well, it's not mine. It's just a Dolly group. It's called the Dolly Scavenges, and we just hang on there. So if anybody ever wants to start some sort of a chat so we can get the Zoom going, that would be fun. Lou is fine. Okay, Lou. Lou, Lou, Lou. So, yeah, let me know whoever's in the mood to do a hangout on Zoom ever. We'll get that going. Oh, good, good. All right, so we're both in each other's group. That's fun. Yeah, so we'll keep in contact and get some sort of – I can do it late, too, especially if my boyfriend works overnight. He's in the chat. He knows. He Sometimes he has to work overnight, so I can do it later. 
Yeah, she has, uh, I think, I don't know if it was two Facebook groups I joined, but I looked underneath, um, underneath her video today and I seen them all right there. Gotta get cookie. Oh, I was gonna say the rose ones already while wow, you're good. You probably will be able to mix it without, I don't know. It was that recipe was tough to mix with a mixer because the, the smoke of the stuff would have been everywhere. Yeah, definitely we'll do, we'll, we'll figure it out. She's, we just said that, I think we just said it was like six hours ahead, five or six hours ahead. Yeah, this has been fun. I'm going to end it now. And I will see you guys tomorrow for my video. I'll have a video up for Valentine's Day at six. Bye. Mwah. Mwah. Thanks for hanging out, guys. Mwah. <laughs>